In this video we're going to show you how the uh, packaging takes care of options. You can see here for instance in the mount wheel tasks I've got a couple of uh, groupings here and I've got two options add light and add security handle. So if I go to create the package for this I simply click on the uh, right mouse button on the mount wheels I select the package and I package a station. And just like all the other stations, it's going to put together the process for me. It's revision 1 because it's the first one I've done here. And it's going to be relatively quick here. Because there's not much details in here right now. And then it gives me the uh, revision history, the package results. It shows you everything's going to Mount Wheels. And it shows me it's putting it in here. Now if I just double click on any of these rows here, it will bring up the Excel sheet. And you can see what it's done here. It's included the word option following the description for the, uh, the groupings here that are relevant to the, the uh, options here. So I'll bring it over here and I just, let's say, minimize this guy, take that away. And you can see here uh, my, so here I've got my secure parts with screws, the first one, the wheel install, this guy, right? And then we have the uh, add light and see it says it's an option. It's automatically putting it in there. It's the presence of the little option icon here that's putting it in, into the uh, notes here. So you can, anyone reading the cover sheet is going to be able to immediately identify uh, which of the processes in the, uh, the package are options. And down here when you go to the add light, you'll notice up here in the description area, add light also has the option uh, flagged with it right here. And same over here with the option here. So you can tell right away if you have any options simply by referring to the cover sheet and looking for the word option in parentheses at the end of any of the job elements shown in the cover sheet.